Manchester City just completed the signing of 21-year-old Belgian winger Jeremy Doku for 60 million euros and we're here to tell you why he's perfect for Manchester City. But before we even begin, we're doing a special giveaway for all our loyal subscribers and we want you to be a winner. You have a chance to win a brand new jersey of whichever club you want and even have it delivered to your doorstep for free. And all you have to do is three simple things. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel, like and share this video and stay in the comments which club shirt you want and that is all i mean are you really a fan if you haven't even gotten your club's latest shirt so get in the comments and win yourself one at absolutely no cost well while you try and win a brand new jersey let's talk about a kid who'll be wearing the new manchester city jersey this is why jeremy doku is perfect for manchester city first of all there's currently a demand for wingers at manchester city over the last year city have lost a few wingers but haven't replaced any of them. Sterling, Mares, and even Jesus, who used to often play as a winger, all left but were not replaced. Now, Foden and Bernardo Silva can actually play out wide, but with Gundogan gone and De Bruyne currently injured, we believe Foden and Silva will now be employed more centrally. That leaves Jack Grealish on the left and Cole Palmer on the right. That's surely not enough squad depth for the reigning European champions, so they had to get in the market. Their first choice for the right wing appeared to be Michael Elise, but he decided to commit his future to Crystal Palace, so City went for Doku. Now, why is he perfect? Because Pep and Man City obviously need a player like him. But apart from City just needing a winger, Doku actually fits into Pep's tactics. He's fast, explosive, good with the ball at his feet, and he loves to start out wide. And if you've watched Pep's teams enough, you'd know this is the exact profile he desires. The gaffer loves his wingers to hug the line and stretch the game as much as possible. Possible. He also loves wingers who can hold the ball and dribble, and that's why he bought Mares, Sane, and Grealish. He also loves fast wingers, and that's why he was able to cook with Sane and Sterling for so long. But when we talk about pace, Guardiola has never had a winger like this at Manchester City. Man, Doku's nickname is the Belgium Flash. That should tell you all you need to know about his speed. Also, this kid is just 21, but he's already been co signed by Thierry Henry. Henri. Henri said if you're one-on-one -on -one with Doku, there's only one thing left to do, pray. For the greatest attacker in the Premier League history to say this about him at just 21 years of age, you should know that he's the real deal. We really can't wait to see his explosiveness in England. But the boy's not just a runner and a dribbler, he's actually a very creative player too. And with Haaland up front, Pep's not really enthusiastic about scoring wingers. What he wants right now are wingers who can create for Haaland to finish, and Doku can do just that. He was also ninth in the entire league for expected assists. So when we say creative, we mean really creative. And now that De Bruyne will be out for some time, City will need as many creative outlets as possible, and that makes Jeremy Doku perfect for the club. Erling Haaland will thank Pep for this signing for sure. And you know what? If Grealish can succeed at Man City, then Doku surely can too. Last season, Doku had had a longer ball carry distance per 90 than Grealish. Heck, he even had a longer ball carry distance per 90 than anybody in Europe's top five leagues. He's up there with 356 meters per 90, while Grealish and Dembele had 317 and 309 meters per 90 respectively. Nah, do not joke with this boy. Another thing that makes Doku perfect for City is his ability to use both feet. So this means that he can play as a left or a right winger. Why this is particularly great is because we all know how tactically flexible Pep likes to be, so having a player who can slot in on either flank is surely a blessing. We expect that City will now typically line up with Grealish on the left, Doku on the right, Haaland down the middle, and Foden just behind them. Now that we think about it, we can actually see Doku being a Sane regen, and damn, you remember how deadly Sane was when he was at City, didn't you? Those were some really scary hours. If Doku who can bring that back? Who says City can't do the treble again? Finally, one thing that makes Jeremy Doku perfect for City is his age. The boy is just 21 years old. Players are much easier to teach and manage at a young age, so Pep 
could actually turn him into a superstar. And a lot of people might not be paying attention, but Pep is actually cutting down on the average age of the squad, which is always a good idea. Right now, their oldest attacker is Grealish, who's 27. It used to be 32-year-old Mares. Apart from Grealish, all the other attackers are under 23. Cole Palmer and Jeremy Doku are 21, while Haaland, Foden and Alvarez are 23. And that's actually insane. So yeah, Doku fits right into that vision for both the present and the future. But what do you guys think about the Belgium flash? Great signing for City or just meh? Do you think he'll actually tear the league apart or do you think City just wasted 65 million euros? Let us know what you think in the comments. While you do that, don't forget that you can win a brand new jersey in our special giveaway. Just make sure that you're subscribed to the channel, like and share this video and tell us what jersey you want in the comments. Catch you in the next video.